Well, hi there, and welcome to BSF Recovery Team. Uh, that's right, we're heading down to Trollhagen uh, for a work weekend. Uh, we have lots of work weekends before Memorial, and uh, that's what we're doing today. We got Abby with us. Uh, she's going to give the weather report. It froze last night. Yeah, it's about 30-ish degrees right now. I don't think it's raining. I think that's just water on the windshield. Um, yeah. Probably a little windy. It's been very windy the past month here. Yeah. I feel like we're in Kansas. <laughs> um, it snowed yesterday a little. Yep. It didn't stay though. Yeah. Gotta put some gas in the wrecker. Ninety two octane. It gets expensive. Sixty eight bucks must not have been empty. Okay, we're fueled up and uh, heading down to Trollhagen. I don't know what we'll be doing today. Um, I know that there's a uh, log broken on the uh, troll bridge and they have a telephone pole to replace it. I built uh, I built the log bridge years ago out of telephone poles and uh, well one of them cracked and broke a couple years ago so they put a log in place and uh, that only lasted a couple years so now they want to put a telephone pole back in place uh, the troll bridge is an open center bridge uh, it just goes over a little ravine and uh, used to be a real real muddy ravine uh, we'd have to drag vehicles out of there all the time um, So we built a troll bridge to go over it and uh, It's worked out real well now. It's not so muddy anymore, but the bridge is still pretty cool So we might be doing that uh, we might be doing other things. I don't know We'll find out when we get there Yes, this is private property, uh, except for Memorial Weekend. That's when we open it up to the public. Well, the telephone poles aren't here yet, but uh, here's what we got going on. We have a broken log that was replaced on the bridge a few years ago, and uh, it's got to come out. We got to put a telephone pole in its place. Well, let's see about lifting this tree out of there. this in the chain and we were able to break the log.
there's one piece. like we're gonna have to get a little different angle on it well that might work a little better removed 
So, the uh, have a uh, excavator, mini excavator coming to uh, set the pole in on the bridge, and uh, that isn't here yet. So, we're on pole duty, dragging poles out to Noid. Got to get in through the trail here. And, uh, Drag them down to the bottom of Noid so they can uh, build Noid up. telephone poles. This time we're going to drag it to the top. We're going to come around though. We're not going up the obstacle. Alright, those were dropped off at the top. Now we get to go down the obstacle. take care of a tree that's on one of the obstacles on white. There's the tree that we got to uh, take off the obstacle. Saw made short work of that. We'll motor on and see what else we run into. Well, looks like we got a blockage here. Yep. Please don't drive over it. That hurts. Oh. We gotta cut it out of the way? Yes. Alright. Well, that one was a little bit bigger. It looks good. Not even this far away.
getting through there. Well, I think we're going to try and save a couple of sections of that to crawl over. Not necessarily with the wrecker, though. <laughs> excavator can set into hills and they're big well thanks for watching bsf recovery team keep wheeling be safe out there and maybe we'll see you in the woods